Are you a subject matter expert who struggles to speak with confidence? Are you losing career opportunities and feeling stuck because of your stage fear and nervousness during presentations? Isn't that affecting your happiness and your family's future? Welcome to the Confident Man Show with Mr. Bashal Sarkar, India's celebrity expert in practical public speaking, where he shows you how to speak with confidence, deliver rock solid confident presentations in front of decision makers without any stage fear. Would you like to become the confident man, gain more respect, and enjoy a happy life? Then listen carefully because this is showtime. For knowing more about the upcoming practical public speaking courses and opportunities to get mentored by Mr. Bishal himself, go to bishalsarkar.com. Again, you can go to bishalsarkar.com. For more information about having a conversation with our team members about your situation, show starts now. Three, two, one, let's go. Hey, welcome to the Confident Man Show with Bishal Sarkar and I am Anupama Chatterjee and today we are discussing about how you can get a promotion without begging. Bishal, do you think it's possible to get a promotion without begging? Absolutely. In fact, I can tell you this, it's impossible to get a respectable promotion by begging. Here is why. How? Who begs? Beggars. Yeah. Who gets a promotion? An employee, a good professional, an expert. You can't yes. you can't expect um you know a professional to beg, but that's exactly what is happening in the world because the challenges are going up and up and up and up because the problem that I see in many people Anupama is that we see ink I mean, it's happening all the time. Like I'm talking to you right now, listener. You are seeing increasing number of people who have less knowledge, less experience than you, but they get that promotion. They get that recognition. They win everybody's respect while you just sit back <laughs> clapping for them. You did good, junior. And they say, thank you, senior. I'm going to make you a junior. Because deep inside, it makes you jealous and it makes your blood boil, but you also feel helpless because there is nothing you can do to stop them since they are confident speakers. So they have less experience, but they are going faster and faster than you getting respect while you are doing all the hard work. So you justify that by saying, well, it's the generation of young people. No, it's the generation of confident people. So I think the reason many people don't understand that you have to get a promotion by attracting is, look, I I hang out with a lot of ultra wealthy people. So, right? Bishal, do you mean that in order to get the promotion without begging, we should work more, we should work more harder and we should work more and more to in order to climb our way to success? I'm going to come to that in a minute. But before that, what I want to say is, you know, I, I hang out with a lot of people who are really, really successful. Okay? okay. So, for example, I'm inviting the famous Mel Martin from USA, the fitness authority of of USA, who has also spoken at Super Coach Seminar. He is actually going to be speaking to my mastermind members just in a few weeks. That's and great. why am I inviting him by doing all the things and, and making all the things? Why? Because first of all, he's my friend, so he has to do it. <laughs> Second <laughs> is because I want the best to seek because I'm not the expert on fitness. I want the world authority on fitness to come help my mastermind people, you know, who, who come to me for not just speaking, the mastermind is all about growing their entire life and lifestyle and happiness and creating a legacy and right. impact. So I want them to learn. And by hanging out with the best people in the world, one of the things I've understood is um, you always reverse engineer an outcome. Meaning you don't just chase the next thing like chasing a butterfly. You know, Jim Rohn says you don't chase a butterfly because the butterfly will create an illusion. You chase it, you never catch it. What you want to do if you want to catch a bee is not chase the bee, but be the honey. So the B comes to you because you are the attractive person. So ask yourself, who do I need to become to your listener? Who do I need to become so that they cannot stop but give me the promotion? Who do I need to become that they feel ashamed and guilty of not giving me a raise? Who do I need to become that they never in their nightmare even think about firing me? Like that's one. Once you understand that that changes everything for you. Is that even possible, Bishar? That is all the time possible. It's happened How? to one of our clients, Alok. He doubled his income. Works for Red Hat. Wow. Search him out. How did he do it? Pretty simple. I'm going to show you some examples and, and case studies and exactly the specific and how he did that. But let me tell you, you asked a question about hard work. Remember? Yes. When I was growing up, I was told that hard work, uh, you know, like you, you just work hard because the harder you get, the... Smarter you get. The luckier you get. <laughs> right? The smarter you get, some people say the luckier you get, the harder I work, the luckier I get. Who do you think works harder, me or a, or a construction laborer? Definitely the laborer and a lot more. Who do you think makes more money, me or the laborer? Probably you. Probably me. I hope so. <laughs> so here's the thing. He works harder than me. 
Yes. And many of us, and, and dear listener, he works harder than you, but he doesn't make as much money probably as you make. He doesn't make one lakh a month. He doesn't make two lakhs a month. He doesn't make 80,000 a month, right? Right. Why? Because it's not about hard work. Now, you'll think it's about smart work. It's not even about smart work. It's about the right work. When you understand how to do the right thing, it changes everything for yourself. Because if you know my story, Anupama, I, I come from a background where people told me you just have to work hard. I did that. I exhausted yes. myself. I worked in first source, worked um, in um, in business standard, you know, opened up a business with IHE group, an e-commerce business. But it not. I was working hard. And by working hard, you know what happened to me, Anupama? What I got exhausted. Like I was panting like a dog. <sighs> I was panting like a dog. And how did you overcome that? I, I implemented the right system in my life. And that's a whole different conversation. That's exactly what I teach my clients, the mastermind people, exactly how to go from hard work to right work and how to go from begging to being big in your life. How to become the attractive personality that people chase you. Do you think uh, Amitabh Bachchan is going to chase anybody saying, give me a work? I think people are chasing him to people give are chasing him, him work. Why? Because he's the attractive personality. He has become the person. He gets that promotion called film yes. without begging right because he be- has become that personality it's not he he does, didn't say that i have to get more you know um, uh, re- certification i have to work hard he just said i have to be that one that one actor that that is impossible to ignore impossible to ignore you are either easy to ignore or you're impossible to ignore so, so let- he became the person in demand a person in demand. And, and let me tell you, a, bi- a big problem that many people face when they have to create a demand for themselves. And, and by the way, you can do this, dear listener, today. In, in, let me ask you a question, Anupama. Do you know some people who are always on WhatsApp? You have a WhatsApp account, right? Yes, I do. Sometimes people message you and, and you message and they're like immediately online and replying like, LOL, smile, smiley, you know, this GIF image. They're always the replying. Time. They're online all the time. Do you have respect for them? Yeah, uh, I do respect them as people, but like always texting and always yeah. messaging, not cool. I'll tell you why. Be highly visible and rarely accessible if you want to be wealthy. Can you tell me more about that? Be highly visible and rarely accessible. I'm highly visible. People say, dude, I see you all the time. I see you on YouTube, email Mr. Bishal. I get your emails. I, I read your blogs. You are everywhere. But people can't, don't know, don't have my number. Yeah. Why? That's the reason I'm wealthy and most people are not. No no judgment. But that's the reality. You have to understand the real, reality of the thing. So um, a bit, to create a big demand for yourself, if, if your boss or team members say, can you do this project? And you say, yeah, sure. You're not going to be a big demand person because you are just being a doorman. People are coming to you only when they wor- need a work done. This is exactly what happened to one of our clients, Mahesh from Mumbai, right? He came to our yeah. program, part of Mastermind. Great I told guy. him, great, amazing personality. I love him. In fact, uh, he has tripled his productivity in his own words, right? He has no more procrastination. He's having a happy life with the work that I did and the mentoring that I helped him with. And he did that because he understood. I mean, one of the time, one of the things that was happening for Mahesh was whenever somebody was coming to Mahesh, he was like, yeah, I'll do this work for you. And then I said, Mahesh, when yes. somebody comes to you right now, say, can this wait for a day? No. Can this wait for two hours? Yes. Great. Make them wait for two hours. Now you are a person in demand because they can't just get you to do all the time all the work so in fact let me tell you the three reputation levels quickly Anupama because I know I can see you have some questions from yes. from from the listeners yes we do have some questions from the listeners and and before we go there um, let me tell you the three levels of reputation that only uber successful pe- leaders know about okay? okay first level is I call it um, the level one reputation Okay, this is the average expert level reputation. The there there is not even expert, level. average professional. Okay. Here, you look at them and say, who is he? Okay. Who's Praveen? Oh, yeah, that guy who works. Oh, okay. Great. Fine. Let's go for some coffee. Like, they don't get any recognition. The second level is where you say, I know Praveen. He's a good guy. See, now he is known to you. He's visible to you. Yes. Third level is you say, I know Praveen. See if you can get Praveen to help you because he doesn't help everybody see if you can get him to give that pr- presentation because his presentation right. is flawless guess what the first one when you are just an average expert nobody knows you in an organization that's a problem and people don't respect you at that level you feel invisible and that's exactly what happened in the beginning of my career i was born in a brought up in a small town called Shiliguri. i did not know anything about all these things about reputation and creating an aura and creating different levels of uh, wealth and success so i was there second level and first of, by the way no judgment but i don't work with these people here i think they are not ready for my level yet they you have to go to the second level which Most is of the question, people have this question like yeah why can i not come into your course because i don't let you 
come <laughs> here and no no judgment no egoistic no hard feelings people it's my home i know who i can best help so if you come and i know you i can't help you the best i'll tell you i can't help you the best if it hurts your ego now i know i made the right decision for sure <laughs> right second level is where you are an average regular expert here people start taking you for granted very very soon like you have great amount of experience knowledge like mahesh was yeah mahesh was many people raj lakshmi was at the at the same level and then he understood that he has to create um a different level but at that time of the second level what another thing that happens is many people are just like you you know there are many domain experts who can learn grow to be the same level but the third level is where you create freedom for yourself here people don't just respect you for your knowledge anupama but they respect you for who you are right so here um you don't beg for promotion you don't fight for recognition you don't chase anybody people chase you people love you you your demand is way more than your availability and here is where you can become happy in your life because the biggest problem i see is a lot of experts have a lot of years of experience and you are seeing numbers of people who have less knowledge than you less like i said less uh, amount of experience than you but they are getting that level of promotion they are getting all these things and only because they are into that third level of reputation so let's go ahead with the question right now quickly quick so today's question this is the question of the day and it comes from rohan mandhania from chennai he is a finance manager and his question is i have been a good performer in academics and in my career and have handled the responsibilities in my field as a finance controller for mnc's like abb india limited from the start of my career however mm-hmm. i haven't worked on my presentation skills overcoming stage fears etc which is somewhere acting as a hurdle in future growth in my career with your little push and support and proper platform i believe i can get back my self confidence and help grow to take on bigger roles and responsibilities please help me yeah i mean the first thing i want to say to you rohan is right now is if you are facing um you know if these things are overcoming the stage fear and lack of presentation skills are acting like a hurdle in your growth you don't need a little push you need a kick in your butt first of all <laughs> here is why Here's why. It's kind of like saying I have had an accident, I need a little band-aid. No you don't. You need no. a surgery right now. It's deep. It's, it's stuck in you. And this is exactly what happened to Alok, right? When Alok first came to me, he was really struggling a lot with presentation skills and public speaking because of which he was not getting the recognition. I yes. worked with him, he's doubled his income. And in fact, he gave a gave a review recently saying I got a got a recently a raise without even asking for it. And it's not just about the raise. He has now been able to let go of all the home loans that he has. He has no more loans. Just imagine if you dear listener, if you have any kind of loans, imagine writing that last check giving it to them and saying i am free how do you feel it's going to be freedom and that's exactly what happens when you become a great speaker so that's my answer to rohan anupama rohan i hope that answers your question now we talk about it more and we help you more in our program the confident expert live experience if you want to explore more opportunities and if you want to reach out to me for a detailed discussion reach me on 8880361 Five two six. That's triple eight zero three six one five two six. And when you call me, uh, if I'm not available, wait for me uh, to call you back because I'm not available all the time. And uh, I wish. you all the best yeah and i i also want to say that the next week's topic is going to be so amazing we're not even going to talk about it right now oh okay that's a secret here are our final words special. final words are always the same and before i tell you the final word let me tell you this other people are more confident and more visible they are getting the promotion wake the fuck up wake up man wake up for yourself wake up for your family wake up for your organization everybody is waiting for you because remember public speaking is not about perfection it's all about connection Congratulations for listening to today's show. If you're ready to become the confident man in your own life, go to bishalsarkar.com and apply for a conversation today. For that, go to bishalsarkar.com. All right, time for me to go. Have a confident day.